Hello, in this video we're going to look at the marginal rate of substitution for perfect complements utility functions. So perfect complements utility function will take on this form. Utility is the minimum of AX or BY. A and B are just positive parameters. The marginal rate of substitution is the absolute value of the slope of the indifference curve. With perfect complements we're going to get L-shaped looking indifference curves. The horizontal part of this L-shaped indifference curve will have a marginal rate of substitution of good Y for good X equal to zero. The vertical portion of the L-shaped indifference curve will have a marginal rate of substitution that is infinite. Here's a utility function. Utility equals the minimum of X or Y. In this case, if X exceeds Y, we're going to be on the horizontal part of the indifference curve and the marginal rate of substitution will be zero. The slope of a horizontal line is just zero. And if y exceeds x, we'll be on the vertical part of this indifference curve and in that case we'll just say that the marginal rate of substitution is infinite. You could also say undefined if you wanted to. Uh, here's another utility function. Utility equals a minimum of 2x or y. So in equilibrium, consumer's equilibrium, uh, 2x will equal y. Or if we're going to construct a ratio, the ratio of good x to good y will equal 1 half. So just solving this uh, for x divided by y. In that case, uh, the horizontal part of the indifference curve will occur if the ratio of x to y is greater than 1 half. So here the marginal rate of substitution will equal 0. So for example, if x is 2 and y is 2, we'd be on the horizontal part of the indifference curve, so the marginal rate of substitution would be 0. The vertical part of the indifference curve will occur any time that the ratio of good x to good y is less than 1 half. So for example, if we have 1 unit of x and 4 units of good y, we'll be on the vertical part of the indifference curve, and here the marginal rate of substitution will be infinite. Okay, that's it. I hope you found this video helpful.